If you have been using your keyboard for years and it's turning out to be a complete mess, here's how you can deep clean your dirty keyboard the easiest way possible. Just right before we jump into showing you how it works, get notified about new DIY cleaning guides and tips by subscribing to our channel. Now, let's get down to it. For starters, you will need the right tools to do the heavy lifting for you. Here, we have a Joint Stars Turbo Mini cleaning kit. It comes with both a blower and vacuum function. With it are two nozzles for the vacuum end and three nozzles for the blower end. You'll also get two additional keyboard brushes and a cleaning gel to take care of tiny specks and grimy dirt. Since this is a deep clean process, you can opt to remove the keycaps if you can do so with the kind of keyboard you have. For most mechanical keyboards, you can remove them, but just to be sure, check out the manual or google the keyboard's name to see if it has removable keycaps or not. Removing the keycaps will get you a 99% deep clean, but if time doesn't allow you to do that, you can still do a deep clean with the help of Joint Stars Turbo Mini's vacuum and blower function. With it, you get 95% spotless clean keyboard with just 20% the effort needed. The first thing to do is to remove any loose dirt and crumbs in the way. You can use Joint Stars Turbo Mini's vacuum function for this with its brush nozzle to agitate more dirt in the way. When that's done, you can take care of the more stubborn kinds of dirt. Just flip Joint Stars Turbo Mini over, attach the slim nozzle, and using its blowing power, go over each nook and cranny, including at the bottom of each keycap to shake up embedded dirt. If you remove the keycaps, you can also go over each one of them to remove dirt stuck under and around it. Next, go back to the keyboard and vacuum it over to suck up the stuck on dirt you just scraped off. After that, you can then take the cleaning gel, put it one spot of the keyboard for at least 5 seconds to get rid of microscopic dust and sticky dirt, then move it to other parts until you cover every corner of the keyboard. If traces of grime are still there, you can also use an ordinary cotton swab, wet it a bit, and go over the grime with it. Now you can put back the keycaps if you have removed them. Here's how it should look after cleaning with Joint Stars Turbo Mini, and see the difference it has before it was cleaned. If you want to minimize the dirt getting on your keyboard, you can opt to eat away from it. You should also use the Joint Stars Turbo Mini on it once in a while to prevent it from accumulating too much dirt again. Want to get more keyboard cleaning tips? Get notified by clicking the bell button and get updated with new posts by subscribing to this channel. To get your hands on your own Turbo Mini, check out the description below to get the link. This is Joint Stars, your superb but affordable DIY.